All right. Testing, testing. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right. So, <laughs> uh, not while well, that's going. Uh, but, oh yes, while well, that's going on, I guess uh, for those who don't follow my Twitter or anything, ooh, I've been pretty sick in the last couple days, unfortunately. I'm feeling, you know, good enough to stream now though, which you know makes me happy. But yeah. Uh, God, I'm trying to remember. Oh yeah, last time things were going pretty well until I did everything out of uh, order, <laughs> more or less. <laughs> so that was fun. <sighs> but yeah, no. Uh. But, um, yeah, okay, last time, yeah, we went to, yeah, Gobi, uh, yeah, last time we went to Gobi Valley, we got through most everything, except for some things that I needed, um, Kazumi's flying charge thing for, which, that was fun. Sorry, just my laptop had a, a thing that made me exhausted for a bit. Love seeing stuff about McGaffrey. Love to see it. It's always great. Yeah, we love to see it. Anyway. <laughs> um, yeah, Gilby Valley. Uh, and then uh, Freeze Easy Peak. You know, we did those two. Well, I did those out of order, but, you know. And also, there's one music note just in the worst place that I just couldn't see. And that was, that was fantastic. Uh, yeah. No, we got that out of the way. And... <laughs> Call me out. Yep. Hi, dude. <laughs> Yeah, let's get things started. And of course, we're playing as the gamers. Uh -huh. Um. Okay, yeah, I have 600 amusing notes now, so I can go on to the next section. There's something... Oh yeah, I want to have... Um... Notepad. Let's plus up. So that I can, you know, write notes as we need to. Oh, I forgot that, apparently. Um, let me scroll up. Uh, Gratimba has apparently spotty purple undies, uh, of course. Vital, vital information. Thanks, Gratilda, for, for the hug up. I was just talking and mad shit about your sister. <laughs> Got that. Um. 
No, that was just... Okay, yeah, we got everything there. Yeah, because there, uh... Let's do the swamp, which had the, uh... The kind of icy area that gave us access to... Uh... Cheeto. The book with the, uh... The spells that, you know, a lot of us had more... Were there more red feathers? No, it was blue eggs. I think that's the one that we have. I forgot that we ha have a shortcut now. Alright. Let me see if I'm remembering where this takes us. I think <laughs> it's like right at the beginning. Yeah, it's right at the beginning. Or it's real damn close at the beginning. Uh, you know what? I haven't really said this much while uh, replaying this game, but this is such a well put together game. Like, <laughs> you know, it's like. Uh, part of me feels like it's weird giving praise to a game that's already kind of universally praised, but they did a lot right. And it shows, like, of, uh, like, everything they've done to kind of make, you know, make everything easier on people. On people. Oh, God. Come on! I hate being sniped by this clown. there. Alright. We're gonna try this at least once more. Yeah, okay, this one's weird of, you know, those speed shoes normally or at least in some levels will let you automatically press down on uh, buttons like this so you don't have to mess with you know, it just speeds everything up. What? Ah, uh, okay, you know what? We can totally get it, it's just... It's just a, such a weird one to get. Well, mostly because of all these camera angles that happen. That you, you have to kind of keep track of. Return the... <laughs> Grunty's legs to some extent. Okay, bye. <laughs> oh, let's double chin. <laughs> Sorry. Throat. I'm still a bit sick. Um. <laughs> Unfortunately. But... Come on. Come on. No! Whack. Okay, I can't use the deep. Yeah, I can't use the deep pad to move. Because yeah, the game uses that for some commands, I think. Wait, does it? Uh, controls. Wait, the deep pad isn't used for anything. K. 
Can I make it? Huh. Huh. Okay. Also, I forgot that. Now it, I'll mess with the settings later. If you know anything needs to be made louder, they can. Okay, that was a mistake. See this? Uh, of this wall. Okay, I think I need to jump. If I jump at the last, or towards the last second, I think I'll actually get it. Actually, before I do that. Uh, can I... I could have sworn... Yeah, there is something up there. That's probably at least one thing I want to grab. Yeah, this timer is just really oddly tight. Like, nothing else in the game feels this tight. Especially, you know, the fact that you're having to fight with the camera angle. Because you... <laughs> if you just... You know, this game doesn't have tank controls or anything, so... Like, if you just keep holding down... Alright. get that? Really? I thought he would be hiding something more. No, he's just obnoxious. Yeah. Thought, you know, I thought it'd be worth to give that a shot. Right, yeah, that was... That'd be your left eye. But, um, <clears throat> not to read from chat. Uh, Pidmon, you need to both beak bomb the right eye and make it to the upper area. Yeah. Memory hole. No, oh, yeah, that's fair. Of uh, you those right eye in the other room. Or, okay, maybe that needs to be unlocked. Or if it's left eye, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oops. Oh no. Oh no. I canceled my flight early. Huh. Yeah, I did break the glass, which... Uh, have I talked to you before? Uh, rat bagels for breakfast. Rat- okay, yeah, rat bagels for breakfast, dog dung burgers for dinner, cockroaches and cream for dessert. Yep, alright, gotcha. So I have- 
spoken to her before. And yeah, I need to fly through there. Oh yeah, we haven't found your belly. Um, this break? Yeah, it still breaks. Alright. <laughs> um. well, I lost that health, so if this doesn't despawn, we'll grab that. And. Oh wait, is this just like the suggested way of doing- oh no. Okay. Fine. Uh... I, I guess I should get into that eye that I unlocked. Or whatever. Since I can't... I feel like there's something here. Was I supposed to break both of them? Uh, I think I was supposed to... No, I... I'll come back later. Uh, is there anything I can do through here? I kind of forgot what's actually in here. Okay, this whole deal. Whole rigmarole. Okay. Um, I think instead we'll make some progress and come back here <laughs> later. Um, after getting more uh, resources. Excuse me, let me take uh, some water. Or take a drink of water. Uh. Yeah, sorry about that. Ah. Uh, the eye, the grunty switch, and the light. Alright. Thanks. Are there things down there with red eyes, or am I just imagining things? Oh no, those are feathers. Ah, uh, good. Oh. Hello. Grunty's plan is rather... <laughs> ah, I can't even do a voice. You guys, just come running. Okay, now give me a second. <laughs> Grunty's plan is no. I <laughs> no. What? I'll I'll come up with it later. I'll try to do a voice. Um. Yeah. My throat ain't doing the best, but. Right. Yeah. Yeah, let's, uh, move on to whatever this is. Um, is this the pirate level? You can bunk him. Oh, 
you know? <laughs> I keep thinking about it, just how, like, Kazooie's doing a lot of the work in this game. It's kind of nuts, like... Even here, she's, you know, doing most of the, uh, breaststroke. Or I guess it's called wing stroke. Uh, for the official name of the move, according to the wiki at least. Is this the only thing we can unlock here? Normally... Uh, no, it may be overthinking things. Because I must say, like, every time we've unlocked a door with the uh, musical notes, we tend to be able to find, uh... the... jigsaw... Uh, bits... for, uh, you know, for a few different levels. So it's like... Interesting, but I don't think there's anything I can do there. I guess I'm just, uh, just trying to think, like, oh, did I miss something of places I can go to? Nope. What happens if I... Shot. 
Okay, nothing happened. Other than explosions. And also, Gratilda. Er, making fun of us. Hmm. Is that just it? Um, wait. Something else I'm missing. I've forgotten that I took so much damage already. Guys, probably just from, uh... Ah, uh, just probably from that fall. Anyway... Is the... No, okay, no, there's nothing here. Right... No, we already acti activated this, but, you know, grabbing more red feathers doesn't hurt. And thank you, Benon, for, uh, uh, yeah, saying, you know, very congratulating on that, uh, honey run, or whatever. Honeycomb? I'm honestly wonder sometimes, like, about that shortcut uh, deal, but whatever. Alright, so what am I looking for? I think I saw the uh, mansion before, and it would be over here, I think. Oh yeah, Freezy Peak didn't have a puzzle, I think. Or if it, or you know, puzzle pieces to pay out. Or if it did, I like completely forgot where on earth I had to pay that out. Oh yeah, it was the top advent box. Yeah. Forgetting the the full name of this place. Rip. Yeah, I should be running for this. It's yeah, I may slip off from just moving fast, but also I won't fall from the slope, so it's kind of my safest movement option. Um, 
Thankfully, I'm <laughs> do, do that fairly well. Uh, that bat is just having a rough time. Good for them. Please leave me alone, bat. Alright. Oh, wait, um, <clears throat> to read from chat a bit, uh, Pinman, Beak attack the gate. Punching's not enough for the, uh, that, that one gate outside this level. Alright, good to know. Cause I was like, oh, do I have to unlock something for it? Cause I kind of forgot. I wonder if a shoulder charge would do anything. Uh, yeah, no. <laughs> I knew there was something I kind of forgot. This musical chair I think this yeah, I think this is the chair section. Alright. Or something. I vaguely remember there being like a musical chairs like thing. Tilda having uh, portrait here is kind of, you know, <laughs> they still have some art of her hanging around. And Mumbo. Had to leave the room and come back in. <laughs> okay, so going up through the top not only got you a Jinmo. Jinmo? 
Jimbo. No, not only got you a Jimbo, but also... Wait, you still awake? I have to sleep. Okay, I remember playing something. Okay, for some reason now, like, could you put out the fire? <laughs> something <coughs> I've forgotten about so let's keep uh, let's keep exploring till I find it I know there's more ways in and out or there's more things to do definitely this ghost. So let's uh, avoid that. been checking um, laptop for a bit, but sorry been on that your internet connection's being so rude. Thanks, dear. And yeah, and I. Game. Yeah. <laughs> oh, today. Nice. Oh yeah, the transformations level. I was about to say what you mean by kidding the pumps. But, yeah, no. <laughs> Huh? 
Oh, that wasn't what I wanted. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Um, can I land on the rose bush and not take damage? Alright, <laughs> that didn't go perfectly well, but... Um, oh no, I'm gonna die. Uh, or not. Okay, there's another thing with spelling Banjo Kazooie. Probably. I can do this. <laughs> Tumblr, the mighty. Okay. <laughs> okay, I forgot that that just kills you. Alright, gotcha. Oh, back to full health. That might well kill this bat. Then try to uh, do this one first. Okay, what is the hit box? It's all right. Some hiccups, but we're back on track. fine without it. So, yeah, let's keep on trucking. Alright, so, uh, we, we gotta meet up with Tumblr again. Or, I say, and I decide to go check out a, uh, hedge maze. Come on, leave me alone. 
can't see you on screen, so I can't do anything about you. Please. Oh, gold feather. Oh wait, yeah, no, I can turn invincible. Something I need to remember, like, you can just straight up be invincible. And again, it's, you know, you, you only have so much of it as a resource. But it is there. Thirty gumbuckums. In the gym. Uh, seems like a good haul of goodies. Alright. Let's head back here. Hmm. Okay, no, that's you know, literally the entrance. All right, never mind. Uh, it? Ah, here it is. Whatever. Um, actually, instead, I'll try to find... Where's that? <sighs> of course, I can't see you from here. Let me pick this up. Hmm. Let me pick this up and try to find... Oh, okay, it's over here. Oh wait. Just get to Okay. Let's try this once more. And try not to immediately be obliterated. to do this one, so I just want to get this one squared away and just be a bit more careful. Alright. 
Um. That? No, that's an A. Banjo. Hmm. Adios, Tom Lawrence. Oh, sorry, just was distracted by a kitty. Oh, wait. Shows you respect with. <laughs> ah, Pidman. Ash, shows show your respect with poop. Get a fuck you. Your response according to standards. Goodness. Also, I love the fact that it's just a tombstone with eyes. And I remember seeing like a documentary or something that uh, about one more being on this game. That rare was like we, we gotta keep putting like just big googly eyes on things. That's that's just how we work. Get this working. Or get through into the cathedral before going on to the head, the other head maze or whatever.
Oh, excuse me, we have a kitty cat who wants to leave the room. There you go, kitty. Oh! Hey. Hey, random ghost. I gave you permission to be so tall. It wasn't me. Oh, wait. I kind of remember this being a thing. I kind of disagree with that block. No, I should leave that one alone. They're, it's just going to keep camping there. I'll grab it later. Alright. I thought doing something to the pebbles. No, I thought that would work. I, that doesn't seem to be. The, oh wait, God! I somehow I forgot I could do this. Let's hand. Okay, the more serious version. Okay, uh... Ah, oh, f... Fuck. What? Trying, you'll get it soon. Uh, yeah. Make sure I'm standing perfectly damn key before doing anything so that I 
don't accidentally hit the wrong one. Second to go, uh. Oh! What's that? Huh. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Give me a second to go, uh, blow my nose, get some water. <laughs> Sorry about that. Should be back. Initiating baby mode. Okay, baby mode's a bit too slow. Uh. 
obliterated. Come on! You know what? I'll just tank the damage. Screw you. Rude. I can turn invincible. Alright. That said, I don't think I can run. Well, I mean, I can run. But I don't know if I can jump. Okay, I can jump. But I can't jump too high. I think. That should be all the musical notes here. Let's move on. And now on the top of the... Yeah. Wait, wrong. Wrong input. This one. This is what I want. Alright. 61% complete of notes. Oh, the 60 to the top. Nice. Nice. 
And don't worry, I did in fact see this. Okay, you can just... Okay, that just opens uh, that maze, you know, the path. Okay, the door unlocked. Alright, alright. I keep saying alright, alright, but yeah, no, just... Uh... Okay, five. Five out of ten jiggies. I still need to get the other honeycomb. And then, uh, thirty-five musical notes. So far. <laughs> okay. Let me not spin the camera around, it keeps doing something weird. Let's hop down here. Ah. I think I'm supposed to come back here as the pumpkin. Yeah, that seems about right. I wonder if the, uh... And they're not pumpkin. The boots would help me with the th thorns? There are thorns, but I'm not sure. But, um, they're... They're aware. Okay. That's where... <clears throat> That's where Mumbo's hut is. Can't slide in there. Oh, okay. Time to 
Tiny jump pad. Thunder. Now, let me just grab all the goodies while I'm in here. Yeah, 71 Munich nuts, so it's good. Oh, I know it. <laughs> I've been wanting to say things, but I've been kind of... Oh, partially. I'm just kind of struggling with me a bit. It's kind of jamming and playing. Oh. Ah, Mumbo proud of pumpkin spell. Make good soup. No, oh, I love there'd be more dialogue after that. Um. Yeah, recently. <laughs> um. Look at us. We're just we're just a little guy. Just a little guy. It's our birthday. Anyway. <laughs> Before I continue, before I get absorbed into the cuteness of being an, an adorably small pumpkin, um, uh, oh yeah, uh, recently I learned about from, uh, sorry, <laughs> my brain's got scattered. I learned that apparently that for, um, Right, I keep forgetting the name of the, the damn... Okay, I'm hoping to be able to walk in there. Anyway... Uh... Oh yes! The... Oh, I keep forgetting the name of the... Ah, great. Um... It's the manga with Lum in it? Uh, uh, or say, or say, uh, yeah, that's Yasura? Probably butcher that a bit, but <laughs> just the fact that it's yet another manga. Oh wow, yeah, this is so much easier. So you know, made by the same, you know, Ronmer one half. And I, did she also do? Great. Now I'm distracted. Uh. Okay, I'm trying to remember. Did she also do? Uh, Inu Inuyasha? Or is that someone else? Yeah. I'm a one half. And you watch that. Yeah, no. Um, the fact that. <laughs> like, there was a. Um... Oh, wait, did I grab everything there? Or was I distracted <laughs> by my story? Ah, that I'm desperately trying to remember all the little details. Which sounds about right. Which is honestly more kind of... Okay, my distractedness right now reminds me a lot more of the streams I do with uh, Mary Robin, Dark Wizard, Jane Mason, you know, on Wednesdays and Saturdays and such, but... Anyway... <laughs> well, the fact that, you know, same author as uh, Robin One Half. Oh, wait. I thought that would be open. No, 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 no. Um, anyway, that there is a character who, is, who isn't too hard to have a trans reading on. Actually, technically two. Because I know in that uh, series, there's this one girl whose father raised her to be, like, he wanted a son. Wait. How? Wait. That's a, wait. How? How? I. 
Um, sound like something's up. Oh, I had to. Okay, I get it now. Um, how do we get up there? Anyway, while I find a way up there to get that jiggy. Um, yeah, no. Um, like, there's a character with a girl, but her father wanted a son and, like, raised her as a son. And, like, she does she, like, wants to try to be more like a girl, and, like, everyone keeps treating her like a guy. And, like, she even dresses up as a guy, and she's like, hey, I want to be feminine. And just, like, look at this character, and, like, how do you, how, how do you, like, you know, it's like, oh, wow, you, you've somehow made a trans woman who's cis, but, like, congrats on that. I, I, I don't know. Not congrats on that, just fascinating. And also, there's some potential uh, gender stuff going on with, um, through, uh, Ataru? That's right. That's the name of the band. Ataru! <laughs> the uh, main character, which is fascinating. Like, even. <coughs> I mean, part, part, part of it, you know, is subtext, but also, um, he gets hit by a gun by aliens, Tengu aliens. Like, make him roll. And just kind of completely fine with it. I mean, also, it's, you know, kind of like a gag comic or whatever, but, like, he is just, like, completely fine with it. And, like, uh, Lum is like, hey, don't act so pleased, because, you know, we can't be married if you're a girl. And he's like, <laughs> and Tara's like, girls can love each other. And, like, <laughs> oh, wait, no, I haven't been in here. Die. Um... Um... But yeah, no, it's just like... Like... Hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you have something going here that you may not have been thinking about. You can bug him. Yeah, that's always fun. It's always interesting to see, at least. Alright, so that's that taken care of. I... Yeah, that wasn't... For some reason I completely forgot about this, so I thought this would be something different, but okay. I came that out of the way, never hurts. Oh! <laughs> yeah, Pidman, um... Um... Uh, Pidman talking about Holly's fake? Yeah, I know, Holly's fake of... Horn replacement therapy is really... <laughs> And just like finding out like some of the inspiration of that, like, huh, this certainly is some 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 trans of gender happening, but in some weird ways. I mean, God, it's supposed to be a gag, but at the same time, just Ataru just being like completely fine and happy with being a girl, and even like having dinner with. The, the cis girl, who's also kind of a trans girl, of just, no, going, <laughs> has trans girl swag, I guess, you could say. Uh, you know, having dinner with her, Lum, and, uh, you know, dinner with them, it's like, ah, uh, it's nice, you know, like, uh, having dinner with just us girls. And just like, yeah, no, the tower is just incredibly, just like, oh, cool. Being a girl. Well, yeah, no, I'm, I'm very much down for this. 
it's just like, huh. And again, the whole of round by one half is just also a weird experience overall, because it's like, like, ma'am, you have some, you have a whole lot of trans of gender happening here. Like, how much of this is, like, intentional? Or how much is, like, you think it'd be haha -ha, funny? Like, can you imagine someone turning into a girl? But then, it, I know parts of it has to be, you know, that has to be. It's probably just, like, of just, now things, like, yeah, okay, um, let me focus my thoughts real quick. Like, you know, there's some things that can easily be interpreted as, like, oh, you know, it's just kind of done this way just because, like, uh, oh, no, let me do uh, a, a solid example before I get, yeah, Unus, uh, Pidman, uh, I'm terrible <laughs> Okay. And her shitty dad, yeah, unfortunately. Her incredibly shitty dad. Um as the character I was talking about. A cis girl, but kinda also a trans girl of just her incredibly shitty dad just not letting her be a girl and everyone just think also thinking she's a guy. Lovely. But <laughs> Um, oh yes, um, for Ranma one half, you know, like, Ranma, for his, like, guy form, only has, like, oh, so many, like, different clothes, right? But, like, female form, you know, has just tons and tons of outfits, and, like, and, you know, <laughs> like, it gives the impression, at the very least, that Ranma feels a lot more, like, if you, you know, to analyze it, like, oh, but Rama at least, you know, seems to have much... Oh, okay. The uh, out there. As the pumpkin. There has to be a way up there as a pumpkin. Anyway, uh... But, you know, that, like, oh, Ram you know, that Rama feels more comfortable or, you know, more excited to be, you know... To actually do different things in, you know, his, like, girl form, but it could also, like, you know, just, um, a meta, not meta, but, like, a, uh, you know, step back a bit, you know, it could also make sense of just, like, the author looking, like, you know, just making art and just the fact that it's so much more common to, like, make art for, you know, female characters, that, you know, in a whole bunch of different outfits and, you know, different cute clothes or whatever, like, it just feels more, and not feels more natural, it's just the convention, it just, you know, conventionally it makes more sense, like, oh yeah, no, you basically play dress up with, you know, these uh, cute girls more than you would with guys, like, duh, it's just obvious, it just, yeah, and it, you know, it's just, you know, there it feels like a thing of like, hey, did you accidentally, <laughs> you know, that feels more of like, hey, did you unintentionally, you know, further the, the evidence that this character is trans, or like, that it's like on purpose, or it's just like complete accident, which I'm guessing like more accident than anything, so, yeah. Yeah, sorry, just, that's been on my mind since I've read the, oh, uh -huh. Sorry, just focusing being a cute little pumpkin and not uh, being attacked by bite by bats
Alright, so let's... Uh, oh yeah, the other honeycomb. Okay. <laughs> uh, what haven't I unlocked yet? Hmm. <clears throat> I get another sip of water. Central um, mansion deal. Uh, we can go back here in baby mode. There's nothing for us in baby mode. Gotcha. Yep. I'm pretty sure I got everything I could before uh before leaving the cathedral. I went to the top of the cathedral. Um see something. Or, I could have sworn that. Actually, yeah, okay. Just wanted to make sure that Pumpkin wasn't hurt by the thorns. If anything weird, I can use that for. Keeps turning out to be a lot more useful than exit to have unlocked earlier. Okay, I thought I saw something here, I guess I'm mistaken. It might have been the bat from a weird angle. Okay, we unfortunately have to leave pumpkin mode, which is a, a pity, but there's not much I'm seeing that we can do as a cute little pumpkin. Oh, I'm going back to... Uh, Make sure I'm half, even halfway pronouncing the series right. Uh, or 
Or Use. Urusai? Urusai Yasora. Like, uh, you know, back with the uh, character Ryuno Uno, Unosuke. Right. Uh, is that, you know, there's one part where she wants to try to speak more femininely, and, you know, her dad just keep badging her uh, about it, and Ataru and, like, some other uh, guy in her class, like, try helping her speak more femininely, and apparently, like, he practices speaking, like, uh, more femininely, and, like... <laughs> His, like, other classmates are like, hey, like, hey, how come you practice speaking like a girl so often? And he's like, never, basically like, never you mind that. Like, don't worry about it. It's cool. Like, it's just, it's just, like, whatever. It's just, that, you know, that is also very much a thing. Of like, like, of, of just a lot of, uh, very, very, you know, that makes it not hard to read into, uh, to have, like, a transgender reading of this character in some capacity. What? Alright. What kind of do here? Got that? You got the thing from being a pumpkin. Let's head to the top. Oh wait, I think I'm remembering. Aha! I knew there were other things to mention. Oh, wow. Okay, that kind of freaked me out for a second, not gonna lie. Like, you know what? <laughs> Do I have to be here with Pumpkin? Come on. Ah, okay, you know what? Okay, I had to be in pumpkin mode. I had to be here as a little baby man. Alright, fair. Alright, now let me see if there's another window I can break. Let's get this. Come, let me out of here. Hey, toilet. Do you want to talk or... Just... Gurgle. Bear is much too fat to fit in. Logos, so. Okay, so, yep, another thing for, uh... Everyone's favorite little pumpkin. Is there another thing? To do? Okay, I don't. Uh, Oh, no, this is... Alright. Um, Pitman. So, do you think Kazooie's the bouncy cap of the pumpkin? And know what? Yeah, I believe it. Because that's something I've always wondered about, like... Where does Kazooie go in these transformations? Like, yeah, most of the time... I guess just... 
transformed but hidden inside the backpack, but if you, the idea of Kazooie being the bouncy the bouncy lid of the pumpkin is very cute. I like it. Landings, little one. And then we get flushed down the drain. No, I guess looking at this. Uh, <laughs> I guess it's not that surprising that Rare would go on to make. Conquer's bad for the for a day. Like <laughs> how many poop jokes there are in this game alone. Like no, yeah. We're gonna take a quick shower. It's off. Um, I'm trying to remember, was that the only exit there? Or am I missing something? Because I only have nine. And I'm still missing 13 musical notes. What on earth am I missing? Okay. <sighs> hmm. What? Um. Uh. Everything I'm missing. No, should I try killing those two ghosts? I don't know. Like, that's something. Ah, my nose is so stuffed. Um, no, oh, that's the first one. <laughs> now I'm gonna go kill those two ghosts, I guess. Like, I don't know what else to do. <laughs> You know, hopefully on the way there, I find something that, you know, actually tells me how I'm supposed to progress, but... <laughs> Bustin' goat. You know, Bustin' makes me feel good. So... Let's do it anyway. Okay. Sure. Sorry, right, I was hoping that would do something. I mean, in, in some games that would have done something, at least. So I, I <laughs> not a complete bust, but huh. Oh, wait. Wee! <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm missing something and I don't know what. Like, we have these three frames. But I don't know what the pumpkin would be able to Just the inside of this again. You know what? I wonder. Am I supposed to fly into things? gonna obliterate myself if I keep doing that. Oh, God, this... No, I've not seen that we're, er, in the later game. Things are a bit more... You know, things are expanding a bit, and it's just sort of weird. That's us like, the game can't, you know, expand in scope with levels or anything, but... Like, I don't know, it just feels odd that we're, you know, almost at two hours, and, um, uh, we messed around. <laughs> yeah, you know, that we messed around a bit. Uh, never getting love uh, the main hub but then spent the rest of it on just one level instead of doing two in a row or like how I uh, normally like doing it This is a fairly big level, all things considered. Like, there's a lot going on. <laughs> oh, wait! Fuck. Yeah, the pumpkin doesn't have an attack. Uh, you know, there's a little pumpkin. Uh, 
No, no, that makes sense. But I kind of wish they had something so that I wouldn't have to switch so much. Goodness. <laughs> had to read from Pinwa. <laughs> Uh, it's been annoying with having to break all the, the door slash glass, including the gate outside before returning it here. Any form, yeah, God, just remember, <laughs> just, uh, getting the pump. And, like, yeah, pumpkin form. <laughs> Alright, yeah. Gotta go. Gotta go. Trans Transmorgify into a pumpkin. Just the extra time of doing this is uh, starting to grant on me a bit. At the same time, I do appreciate pumpkin form. Cause look at you, just so cute. But yeah. Who are you? You can get her on that? Excuse me? What's it? Wait, how am I still missing 13 musical notes? Like, what am I missing? Like,. Same here. There's okay. I was hoping that there'd be something. And I was like, no, what it was when I saw it. But yeah, no, that's not the case. So there's the central house, the maze, the cathedral, uh, the shed, the uh, little swamp area, whatever this nonsense is, or er, this is the shed, but yeah, you can't, like, enter through the holes with light in them or anything. That's how they look. Uh. Um. I'm gonna try the swamp area again? I think I'll just have to look up here in a minute, because, like, yeah, no, we're gonna have... First episode that's just, uh... One... Wait. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say, um, an episode that's just like one level. Feels wild, but like, no, I, yeah, I feel like that's bound to happen. A game like this. 
Oh, that doesn't give me any new options or anything. Neither is that. Swamp area, the f little fountain with the timer for the uh. Oh, yeah, I think we just said look. look at what areas they there are in here or something. Because, <clears throat> yeah, no, this is getting to be a bit much. I know I 100%ed this <coughs> a few years ago, I even. Yeah, with no guys or anything. So I'm just kind of bewildered that there's something I missed with 13 musical notes. At, at the bare minimum. Yep, got that one. Yep, got that one. Oh! Oh yeah, the Jingo, the, wait, Jingos, yeah. Yeah, I'm missing a Jingo, what? <coughs> huh. Oh, oh I'm suffering, okay. Yeah, uh, sorry to hear that the uh, tree, yeah, the lag is hard to help, but apparently there is a bedroom I missed. I think? Let me go back to that. Uh... 
Okay. Yeah, I'm supposed to smash a window somewhere to get the last Jingo. Jamo. Jingo James. What have you. any of these windows. But, yeah, I saw something. Oh, let's see here. Something about a bedroom. This one again, just to make sure. <laughs> yeah, okay. No, nothing up here. Side level. Oh, I have to do something to come back in. Oh. <clears throat> that explains a lot, to be honest. Yeah, let's. Let's. Uh. This game. <laughs> um. This is the entrance. I love how violently they die. Pumpkin mode. Uh, 
Oh, that's not like the worst thing ever. That said, I'm still wondering about those musical notes. I doubt. I hope. I don't have to go pumpkin. Come out. And go back in. Of just somehow that gets the rest of the notes. The, the pimpin states like now you gotta burst open the gate outside. We'll go back in. Like, oh. These don't. Okay. Sure. Whatever. What? Maybe. Maybe I left some notes. <laughs> Secret preview? MJ for real. <laughs> oh, wait. <clears throat> Oh my god, you got the secret preview. Uh, they actually made that a for real transformation to me. And that's really funny. Of just. Laundry machine. That's cute. No, it, it's fascinating, like, how much they probably were working on to me. Or. <laughs> Yeah, well, then again, I say that, but then again, they, they were working a lot on Dewey and this, because they had the whole stop and swap, stop and swap, stop and sw swap, yeah, you know, ready to go. I'm just a little, little guy, don't hurt me. Little guy, don't hurt me. Um. Oh yeah, and uh, Pinot says there's a gag dialogue from Mumbo about maybe later doing a T-Rex. Which is again a two-way transformation too. Or er, lol. And yeah. That's noisy. Yeah, that's how you access that level. done with that level, but, like, yeah, I should totally, you know, do, you know, might as well do the baby mode stuff now. It might be a Cheeto. I think I remember that being a Cheeto, but, like, gosh, I am still thinking about, what musical notes am I missing? Like, gosh, 
Oh yeah, I was earlier I was gonna say, you know what, I should really talk more about, I guess, my experience with this game and, you know, I guess other N64 games as well. <laughs> like, while streaming this, but at the same time, I've, I've been really sick. I've been really tired. <laughs> So, just being able to just vibe. Wait. Oh, wait, no, I think I see it. Yeah, the little baby. Alright. Uh, yeah. It has smelly socks. And thing. Check my notes if I ever put that down. Uh, yep. <clears throat> but yeah, no, it's just I've been through. Oh, I just haven't really talked about it too much. I'm sure of that. Right. Um, how proud they are, you, stu you sh stupid shorts. A target for my dumb cohorts. Well, they get. <laughs> Red feathers. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Let me just. Yeah, I think ending today with red feathers is all right. All it feels weird to not 100% a level, but like I don't. You know what? I think. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try, like, to just... <sighs> Maybe look those up. Like, I don't know where I'm assuming. But... Ah, let's get red feathers. Let's just have so much flight. Just ludicrous amounts of flight. Also, I love how I search for 100 notes on Bad Monster Mansion and... Just, yeah, other people having, uh, yeah. uh, oh, hmm? Wait, wait, okay, let me read this, um, hmm, a hundred notes on that Mad Monster Mansion? Banjo Kazooie, Xbox 360, uh, on uh, Game Facts. Um, I might have the name of the level wrong, but you know what I mean anyway. I'm four notes short, and I've read the note guide, and I've gone through the level several times. I still can't find the missing notes, and I've beaten the game 100% on the N64, but for some reason, I can't find the last four notes. I could have sworn all the notes on the guide are the notes I've collected, but I could be wrong. I guess. All in all, my question here is, is anyone else having the same problem? And if anyone else knows how to fix that problem? <laughs> and no one replied, like... Oh, my god, this is 13 years ago, yeah. Are you serious? Those are the exact notes I didn't think I picked up. There's no way to fix this? Uh, 
Uh, oh, accepted answer. No, there is no, uh, no way to fix the game breaking glitch. I'm sorry. You have to restart. Uh, Banjo Hussle. Wait. Oh no! Other answers. Did you do the bottles puzzle before you completed this world? If you did, the banjo you saw take the four notes in the puzzle. I think by the bottle it means tumbler. Uh, you know, the four notes in the puzzle actually snatched them from the real level. Since notes stay collected now, the game thinks you already picked them up, but you didn't. But didn't add to your score. Oh no. Oh no. No I I'll if that's the case, I'll mess with that later. Let's end the let's end this. <laughs> Is the bottle bonuses? A bottle bonus? What do you mean bottle uh Bottle bonuses. Yeah, I don't know if I like, that's the only thing I could think of for the bottle things, of just being actually not... Oh. Of not being actually, um... Uh, bottles, the character, but like... I think it may be talking about the Tumblr thing. And again... Bottle bonuses. Then again, I feel like... I don't remember what the bottle bonuses are. Hmm. I don't know. Like, this is just a weird thing, because, like, I've gone through so much of the level. There you go, so much of the level. And I don't know where the last musical notes could be. But now I, I'll try and look it into it, and like, uh, wait. yeah, I'll try and look into it so that by next stream we can like just get those, and like no, you know, no longer have to worry about it. Um, it's talking about the Tumblr thing in the in the bottle bonus though. Mm. Unless it's a pause menu too. Let me read that again. Did you do the do bottles puzzle before you completed this world? And the puzzle actually snatched from the real world since it's not collected. Not the pause menu. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's, this is just weird. Like, I don't remember, like, I remember completing this game. Getting everything before, so I'm just like, how am I missing 13? But anyway, let's... Woo! 
Okay, I can spell. wants to head over uh, back to that one level, but like, if I save and quit, no matter what, like, I'll start at the beginning of Grunty's, like, uh, layer anyway. So yeah, I think we're gonna end it here. Thanks for joining me, y'all. So I have things about, you know, I've been kind of silent, then again, also still sick, so like, uh, yeah. <laughs> No, I, I'm not judging myself too harshly on that. But, er, it's, I still wish to talk more. I know that's a thing probably a lot of people who stream and whatnot, you know, still think about. But, yeah, no, um, yeah, thanks for watching. This is weird having a not 100% completed. Wow. Oh. We got red feathers, and we did all the, uh, the nonsense. Oh no, I still have to do some of the nonsense. For getting the jiggy that's now in the eye. Or, maybe I can do some something. Anyway, thanks for <laughs> watching, y'all. Really appreciate it, and I hope y'all are enjoying yourselves. <clears throat> Oh wait, did you jump into the Banjo-Kazooie stained glass window? I didn't. Uh... Okay, you know what? Wait, you know what? We're not over, actually. Wait, no. Okay, okay I thought it was going to start a new file there. I... I want to get this over with now. I want to have <laughs> a level 100% in. Because I am... Uh... Real. Um, no, I'm... I don't know, I just... It feels weird to not have... A... Uh... I partially... It's also because at the end of every, you know, all these streams, I write in the description what levels I've 100%ed, and, like, having none just feels weird. So, um, wait, no, it's, well. Yeah, it is. Uh, Alright, so I partially want to be able to write something down, like, hey, 100%. So, we're gonna... <laughs> I'll try that out. If it doesn't work, then we tried. Because I think that was, like, the one thing I didn't try to do. Area. 
Wait. Wait. this pirate I think that's a character in the second game oh yeah I'll check the church rafters again Actually, first let me jump on top of this. Alright, just... Hmm. Not mentioned top floor. Did you check inside every room? You know what? I'm wondering if there's more in that room there in the center of the screen. Because I am so, so close. Center here. <laughs> Obliterated. <laughs> and up there was a Jinmo, Jinjo. Have you? All right, let's check the other side. Yeah, I was like, oh no, like pump. Well, we gotta get pumpkin up here. I know that would intrins that would intrinsically not work. But yeah, no. Uh, the other side having a window was something I, I didn't think about. Okay. Oh! 
Bloodlust. Anyway, wait. Uh. We did it. We did. Ah. <laughs> uh. Next, you know. Whatever. We did it. Mad monster. Monster Mansion. A hundred percent. An hour, thirty six minutes. Fifty four seconds. Anyway, thanks for watching. Sorry for being so silent. I'll try to talk more, but yeah, I've been kind of sick all week so far, so yeah, I've been kind of passed out most of the time. Oof, anyway. <laughs> ah, <laughs> sorry. Just again, just something hidden in just the one spot I, I wouldn't think to look. Just causing uh, problems. Anyway, Thanks for watching. I hope y'all had fun. I I had fun just chilling and jiving with y'all. <laughs> Vibing with y'all. But yeah. <laughs> See y'all later. <sighs> Double fun.